just talk about how today was and, and what kind of you got you guys got out of not only today but the week. Yeah, I thought today went pretty good. You know, offensively, I thought uh, you know we moved the ball well consistently. Um, I thought we did a good job running the ball, or running back <coughs> the tackles. And we had a lot of big big runs today. Um, I thought Juwan did a good job being consistent, moving the ball down the field. You know, we still got to work on getting some bigger plays in the passing game, but. Um, as far as his accuracy was better today, it was more on time. Um, you know, there, there are certain situations that go on in these scrimmages that are really good learning experiences for him too. You know, like certain situations like the red zone where he can't, you know, take a sack. And it's really good to get him going through this stuff. So uh, I thought today went pretty good overall. Has, is the timing? I know he, he had talked about it, and Coach had talked about the timing early on. Is it? Is it there with him now? Yeah, it's getting better. You know, and it's uh, part of that is just getting more comfortable with who he's throwing to, and um, you know, the, the more comfortable with the offense, and you know, the the progressions that he needs to go through, and the timing of them, and how all that works. And you know, our defense is always changing stuff up, so stuff's always coming up, you know, which is good. And uh, you know, just continue to learn. How close can you make it to game action? I mean, it was it was there today. I mean, today we, we ran the, just like a game. So we had the clock, the 40 second clock going. You know, the, the ones would go up, and if we drove the ball down the field and scored, then the twos would go. If we got stopped, we'd punt. You know, so we did it today just like a game. Is he getting to the point where you want him as far as the leadership and taking command of the huddle, the, the little things that Lamar was so good at? Yeah, yeah. I mean, Jawan's always been good at that. You know, he's always been a really confident guy. Um, he does a good job. His teammates really respect him and you know the authority he has in the huddle. Um, you know, there's still a, a learning process to it, certain things he's got to get better at. But uh, I mean Jawan's always done a really good job of um, being a leader and trying to push his teammates and you know all those attributes that he has. What'd you get out of Malik? Uh, Malik did a good job today. Uh, we had we made Malik live today when he ran. So if he went past the line of scrimmage, he was live. You know, and you know Malik's you know, kind of like Lamar, where his one of his better attri attributes is his legs. You know, he can really run the ball. He's he's quick. He can make guys miss. Um, you know, he did a good job today running the ball. And he, he also did a good job in the, in the passing game. It's something for him that's still, you know, it's, he's got a learning curve and he's he's picking it up more and more every week. So he could have got better. We talked to him the other day, and he talked about having to be ready, just the next play kind of thing. Is he getting there in your in your eyes? Yeah, he's getting there. I mean, you, you can see his progression every week. You know, he, the timing of it's getting better. Um, his technique is getting better. Um, it's something we still got to work a lot on. You know, at times he's overstriding, and which makes the ball go high. But, uh, you know, he understands his role right now, and he knows he's got to be ready to play. You know, anything could happen. And he understands it, and he's working hard to get there. How Why? Close is, how close is the offense with Juwan to the offense with Juwan? Uh, I mean, there's there's similarities. I mean, we always have our base offense. I mean, obviously with Lamar, there was a lot of quarterback run game and um, you know stuff like that. And so Juwan can do all the same stuff that Lamar could. He can run all those same plays. Um, but you know, Juwan also brings the other factor of being more under center and more of uh, what you saw with like Brian Brown and Michael Bush and that type of offense and be able to run the ball downhill and physical with our running backs. So. Um, you know, Juwan really gives us the ability to do both, and uh, you know, it's, it's going to make it harder on defenses. So we're looking forward to it. What have you d done in, in spring to, to deal with? It seems like there might be not, not a ton of running backs on the roster yet. What, what have you done about that? Yeah, I mean, it, those guys are getting a lot of work. You know, and then we got some guys that walked on. You know, are doing a really good job for us. I mean, the one uh, one kid, Berkeley today, had two long touchdown runs. He took most of the reps with the twos, and you know they're, they're doing a really good job. But they're getting a lot of work this spring, so it's good for them. Trey Smith's been doing a really good job, him and Tobias Little. Nick, you talked about the, the passing game and plays down the field. How are some guys that are standing out? And we've we've heard a lot about Tutu, and even Jawan talked about. It. Is, is he that big of a difference maker because of his speed? Yeah, I mean he's a he's a guy who can catch a short route and go get you 30, 40 yards because he's so quick and fast and he make guys miss. Um, and also, you know, he has the ability to get down the field with his speed and he has great hips. He can turn and catch the ball and, you know, he does a really good job catching the ball down the field and running the ball down. And, you know, his type of speed is going to be something that's going to really help us out.
How do you find ways to get him the ball in space, and how does he, do you think, compromise for his lack of size? Um, you know, we, we have certain plays, you know, to try to get him the ball in space. We, we can put him in different positions, and, you know, eventually we're going to get to where we try to, you know, bring him a lot like we do with Travion Samuel sometime and run some certain plays with him. But, uh, um, you know, we, we've even talked about, you know, possibly having a package for him at some point. And we try to you know, get him to play quarterback a little bit. So it's, uh, you know, he's a kid with a lot of ability. He's still learning the offense, and you know, every time we break the huddle, he's looking around on where to go. But when he, you know, starts understanding everything better, we can, you know, put a little more on him. But he's going to be a really uh, exciting player. All right. Thank you. Thank you.